Crap. Still no sign of him. Might as well head on home. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait. As he sees the portal open up and Stang walks out of it. <laughs> Wait, is he working with the Lucky Villains? Doesn't seem like his type of thing, but. <sighs> as he follows Stang slowly, but making sure. Yeah. He ain't going nowhere, just in case. As he does see another hero about to get attacked, he swoops down and captures Stain. Even key binding him, so yeah, there's no way he's breaking out of that. But Stain does try to actually overpower it through sheer fear. He tries to use his bloodlust to scare Izuku to let him go, but. Uh, He's, he's, he's almost died several times, so it doesn't really work on him. <laughs> yeah, one hell of a training regimen he has. As he starts talking, Stain about his ideology, how hero society has grown weak and more depending on fame and fortune, Izuku actually agrees. But Stain's okay, so. What, you want to help me? No, no. Though I agree with what you're doing, the way you're doing it is wrong. What? What are you talking about? I give it like this. Um, yeah, you kill all, all the fake heroes, but that would just make us more desperate for them. And that will make more fake heroes just to fill in the gap. To a point where they're just giving away, you know, hero licenses. And then your pro problem with fake heroes will just grow. Uh, no, 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 that, that, that's, it makes sense, doesn't it? The less heroes we actually have, the more we'll need them. For when things go bad, and... Think of it like this. If we were to, you know, yeah, crack down on the fake heroes, like take away some of their earnings or screen time, make it feel like, yeah, you're not, you're not going to get nearly as much screen time or pay if you keep acting like you're acting, they might, they might change. Well, quote unquote change. But they're still doing it for the wrong reasons. Instead, why don't you lead by example? Show how being a fake hero will pretty much get you little to nothing. While true heroes like All Might. And, you know, the heroes that work in the shadows like Eraserhead and so on and so forth. Yeah. If you show them that that's a better way. Get more fame, get more fortune, all that crap that they like is. Yeah, they're gonna want to change a little bit more. Still for the wrong reason, but. Mm. So, what are you saying? Lead by example. Show them how being a real hero is a lot more fulfilling. Like, there are some heroes I'm positive. Who would just leave a kid to die if it's for the greater good or they're not willing to risk their lives for a few people. I, I know that there's someone out there like that. There's no doubt in my mind. So, why not show the depths of your convictions? Not by killing the fake heroes, but outdoing them. Hmm? That way, yeah, you get your message out. What? Fuck. How about this? As a hero, you can even out the fake ones. You know? 
I I didn't really think. Well, I can't really be much of a hero with my quirk. What is it? Well, blood curl. Huh? Um, you see, uh, depending on the blood type and how much of it there is, anyone's blood I taste, I can paralyze. Oh, that explains the knives. That explains. Okay, okay, that makes more sense. How do you kill heroes? Wait, what? Yeah, I mean, you obviously trained according to your build. Yeah, you've you've done your shit. No, no joke. The thing is, some of the heroes you take down, they have some good quirks. Huh. So yeah, if all you need really is an opening, and like, how much blood would you really need? Really, a drop would work. Oh, okay. So yeah, the, that explains a lot. So one drop, you got your opening, boom, dead. So, but yeah, you can do that with villains. You don't have to kill them per se. I mean, you could say it was an accident, wink, wink. But still. Yeah, but I'm honestly shocked. What do you mean? Well, uh, you knew who I was. You came after me for what? To stop the hero murders. But you had me, well, technically you still had me at your mercy. Why don't you just take me to the police? Um, how should I put this? Well, <clears throat> there are usually two sides to every story, multiple sides, depending on how many people are actually involved. I, for one, actually wanted to hear your side. What? Yeah. I wanted to hear why you do what you do. I was sure there was more to it than just killing bad or fake heroes. I just actually wanted to hear your ideals instead of just, you know, turning you in. Who knows? Maybe even convince you to turn yourself in. You have that much faith. Well, sometimes faith is all you can really depend on. <laughs> what are you talking about? People have faith in heroes, but yeah, faith is sometimes all we have to go on, like hope or, and laughter to some. So you just had faith that uh, you're a, a very weird kid, you know that. I do. I really do. But still, I at least want to hear you out. <sighs> I, um, I honestly, I did not expect this. Yeah. But yeah, uh, either way. I do agree with you with what you say about Hero Society. I just think there's a better way of doing it. Because believe me, sooner or later, people will catch on to some of these fake heroes without you offering them. They'll catch on to it a lot sooner when you see how good a hero you are, or at least can be. But I... Um, what makes you so sure I can be a hero? I'll just put my faith in you. <laughs> you just put your faith in me. Wow, that's... Uh, you're crazy. I know. So... What are you gonna do? Cause either way, you're getting 
You're going to get uh, turned into the authorities. Do you want me to do it? Or do you want to do it yourself? <sighs> you know this might put a damper on some things, right? I do have fans. Oh, I'm sure you do. But if anything, they might change their tune once they see your new outlook. And the one thing I know is this world isn't fair. You can't heal the quirk you're born with. Whether you have one or not, either. Your financial, social standing. <sighs> It's really just the luck of the draw. Some some of us get a crappy hand, others they hit the jackpot. But it's what you do with that life. It's what you choose to do with the cards you've been dealt and turn it into a winning hand. Uh what I <sighs> Well, I guess I can put my faith in the future. Hope for the best. <laughs> yeah, I guess. But if, if it means anything from a hero killer, I think the future of hero society will be... Huh. It'll do pretty well in your hands. What's your name? Oh, Izuka Midoriya. Hmm. Alright. What's your hero name? Um, I'm not going to tell you. What? I want you to know my actual name. <sighs> because I think you should be able to, you know, when you hear about me and hear my actual hero name, I think you should uh, be able to recognize that it's me just by the look. Huh. You're one hell of a kid. Alright, I'll turn myself in. In that case, I'm leaving. What? You're not going to stay and watch? Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> Let me guess. You're putting your faith in me. Now you're catching on. Izuku flying off, staying, calling the cops, and waiting. As, yeah, as soon as it, <laughs> it go, comes out that, yeah, Stain's been apprehended, he didn't fight back or anything. The League and Shigaraki are like, what the fuck? Toga, Stay, Stain's main, you know, groupie. Spinner, Dobby, they were looking to say, what the hell happened? Which, they actually do question Stain. He gives them a little speech about how yeah, this world's unfair. Pretty much rehashing everything Izuku told him. But then it's... He does something not... Izuku did not expect. He actually calls out Izuku's name. And says, yeah. Expect great things from that kid. Everyone see, seeing this on TV is like, who's Izuku Midoriya? Inko watching on the news. It's like, he didn't. Tenya Ida, Tensei, anyone who knows Izuku are just like, what did he do? What did he say to make this happen? Did, did he really just. 
want to stay out of the face, the eyes, the radar of the media up until my debut as a hero. God. <sighs> they probably think my quirk is negotiation or something now. Oh man. As yeah, reporters and all the laggers like well, just asking him a whole shit ton of questions. Pretty much, what would you expect them to say? Just like uh, how you know Stain? How how what'd you do? What'd you say? Get him to turn himself in? All that shit. Just. No comment. Him just walking off. Them just trying their best to really talk with him, but no, he. <sighs> well, now I'm trapped at home. At least I would be. It's a transmission straight to the upper bot time chamber in which Dende, Curran, Trunks, they're looking at him. So you, you, you just couldn't, you, you couldn't behave yourself. You had to do some bullshit. Hey, I didn't tell him to name drop me. You should have just gone with your hero name. I didn't want to. Besides, it sounded cooler. At least I think it sounded cooler than when I told him. Ugh. You're an idiot. I know. You you really are an idiot. I know. You know what? I'm an idiot. You're catching on fast. <clears throat> well, let's stop teasing Izuku, shall we? Let's just, you know, beat this motherfucker's ass. What? As Curran and then they just raise their hands like, I second this. I third. Izuku being dragged into the high time chamber and put through the ringer again. Upon coming back to UA, everyone there is staring at him. When it comes to 1A, everyone is pretty much asking him a crap ton of questions. Bakugo being hella pissed. That, yeah, he pretty much got the spotlight. He got the seal of approval from the hero killer that he's going to be a great hero. Well, Bakugo, all he did was really uh, get an etiquette lesson. Is yeah, everyone's just pretty much. What did you do? As Ida shows up. Um, look, Ida, him just bowing before Izuku. Thank you so much. What? My brother, he, he's. Able to walk again, he can still be a hero thanks to you, huh? He, yeah, he told me that uh, you gave him this medicine or whatever that helped heal him. I, I just want to say thank you so much. Uh huh. Yeah, j just thank you. Uh, I um uh. Is it wait? You healed him? As I was like, medicine? You mean that being that you. You told all my. You, they weren't anymore. You lied? <laughs> Wait, you, you lied to the number one hero? Everyone was looking. It's like, why? It's like, I. Uh. Oh man, it really hit the fan now, didn't it? As, yeah, everyone's looking like, what, what kind of medicine did you give him? Why did you lie in all my saying there wasn't any more? Like, uh, 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 I didn't lie, per se. I didn't have any more on me. But I may have a way to get more. Do you know what that can do for the hero world? all around yeah I do but do you know what could happen if villains got their hands on it
Oh. Yeah. Exactly. So, okay, yeah, that makes a lot more sense. Yeah. But you still didn't have to lie. Fuck you.